All right, so I'm here at U-Polar Parts in Rosemount, taking a look at this 1977 Bonneville. That's being scrapped. You can see we have the back seat in here. The bumper is missing. The wheels are off. Definitely has a flat tire. And this window is broken. Let's see what this is. <clears throat> It's a headlight lens to a Grand Prix. <laughs> Overall, we have the center console in here. Everything looks pretty sharp for its age. The interior, despite some dirt and broken glass, is actually not bad. Let's go around to the driver's side. Have a, take a look at the interior. Oof. Sticks a little bit. Wow. These seats are so comfortable. This is insane. Uh, I'm going to guess that's actual mileage right there. And the reason I say that is because look at the pedals. Barely worn at all. Um, let's see, we're missing the mirrors. If there were mirrors on this thing. Looks like there was at one point. And this would be to adjust it right here. It's missing. Um, this thing had power windows. Overall, it's a pretty nice looking car. But, <clears throat> take a look down to the frame. And we'll see how that looks. The frame, believe it or not, actually looks really solid. You can see under here, not a ton of rust. It's obviously rear wheel drive, as you can tell. Have the drive shaft going to the back here, and a differential. Um, take a look at the strut towers in the trunk. Ooh, heavy. Go. Ooh, this is just this is interior material is cardboard. It's just peeling away. The interior strut tower looks to be not in terrible condition. But if we look under the hood over here, look at those. Have holes through them. Yeah. Everything under here is just completely rusted. You can see straight through to the tires. It looks like we have an eight cylinder engine here. A lot of it has been disassembled. Got the distributor back here, which actually looks to be in good condition. Um, the car had air conditioning. We have an AC compressor. Um, yeah. And you can see there's a lot of cosmetic rust going through it actually. And there's a dent here, easy fix, but still it's a dent. The bumper is falling off. As you can see the tail lights here. There's a lot of corrosion starting along here. And man, oh look, we even have a speaker in here. Let's take a look at that. If I can reach it. Alright. Oof. Doesn't have any markings on it, so I'm gonna guess it's probably stock speakers. <laughs> um, yeah. Take a look at the trunk lid here. Oh, yep. Proof that's a Bonneville. Look at that. This thing came from Nebraska. that paint is terrible. And we have a grill for what looks to be maybe a Chevy SSR or something. <clears throat> Overall, this car is in really rough condition. Would it be worth restoring? Well, again, bring up the thing where 
we have serious major rust on everything would have to be welded back um, and when you see paint that's looking like this yeah I'm actually thinking this is not paint this is not paint what is this does this have a removable top could be a hard top convertible is what I'm thinking nah it doesn't look like but maybe I'm honestly not sure what that is. Wait a minute, what's this, what's this? We have this little thing up here. Oh. Huh. To be honest, I don't know what that is. But let me just tell you. The seats in this thing are so comfortable. And it really is a sharp looking car. And, oh hey, there's NASDAQ. Rest in pieces. Yeah, so. Sharp looking classic, seen better days for sure. But if I do a little video on this, and <clears throat> here she is again, 1977 Bonneville.